Hello everyone. Today I'll be speaking to you about urotrocil incision using thulium laser. Urotrocils are secular outpouching of the distal ureter into the bladder. These are congenital condition and the most common theory is incomplete dissolution of the chavless membrane in utero. It is seen in 1 in 4000 children and it is more common in female as compared to male. 80% of the urotrocils are usually associated with duplex system. The common treatment is observation when there is not much of hydronephrosis or obstruction and patient is asymptomatic endoscopic incision is the most common treatment which can be done either using collins knife or laser excision and reimplant is a common treatment usually in pediatric patient where there is obstruction of the upper moiety due to urethral and reflux of lower moiety due to psychoureteric reflux pyloureterostomy can also be done when the when one moiety is normal and one moiety is having obstruction due to ureterosy when ureterosy causes obstruction and loss of the function of one particular moiety especially the upper pole moiety then heminephrectomy is needed and very rarely in case of orthotopic ureterosy single moiety single system we may need nephrectomy when it results in non functioning of the kid here in this case we have used laser because patient was a young male and we wanted to avoid using 24 sheet to resect the or give incision onto the urethral a laser can be easily used using a 22 french sheet and we can have a very clean and nice cut as demonstrated in the video to make a urethral incision during initial cystoscopy we can see the ballooned out urethral seal of a single moiety using thulium laser set at 50 watt the incision is given parallel to the floor of bladder a smiley shape The smiley incision is given because the upper flap acts as like a valve and can prevent vasoureteral reflux. The incision is deepened all around till we see a healthy posterior wall of the ureteral mucosa. Once that is done, we can see the collapsed ureteral seal, and we don't have to put any stent post incision. Usually, a catheter is placed for 24 hours, and patient is discharged as day care. Thank you.